Captain, there's something heading our way extremely fast. It's coming straight at us. I've never seen anything like it before. Action. Racing. Fun. Adventure. Nintendo 64, the fastest, most powerful games console on Earth. Now at 99.99. I played Minecraft using an N64 controller. Now before the video begins, I do want to say that only some people who do watch my videos are actually subscribed. So if you do enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe. It really does help out the channel a lot. And comment what else you want to see in the future. And maybe I'll do it, who knows? I most likely will do it, I have no ideas. Anyway, I did Minecraft on an N64 controller. Now you may be wondering, what, what's an N64 controller? What the, what are you on about? You are, you're so weird. You're a funny guy, Chisa, dude. What the, what? Now, now let, let me tell you. In, you know, the 1990s, Nintendo, you know, Nintendo, they made Mario. Mario, they made Mario. They, they released a new console called a Nintendo 64. And it held a lot of games. It held the first 3D Mario game, <laughs> the Super Mario 64. It also held a few other games, which, it held a few other games, trust, tr it had a few more games, it had a few more games, than only Mario 64, I don't, I know them, don't, I do know them, I just, you know, Mario 64, but yeah, it held a lot of games, like, mainly 3D for the most part, I'm pretty sure, and they had quite a funky looking controller, you'll be able to see it on your screen now, now, I know that you can play Minecraft on various consoles, you know, the Xbox, the, uh, PlayStation, the, the Switch, even even the DS had Minecraft, I'm pretty sure. So, I used to actually own an N64 when I was a child, and I wanted to, you know, play Minecraft using the controller. I had no clue why. I was like, you know what, what if I played Minecraft using a Nintendo 64 controller? So, I looked, and I looked, and I looked, and to my surprise, I couldn't find one. So then I went onto Amazon and just bought one, and, and here it is. Like... You know, it's quite cool. A bit bigger than I thought it was, and... I hate it. I I hate it so much. It's so hard to hold. You you can't hold the, like, both sides. You have to have one hand in the middle. It's just so awkward. But it's mine. And I like it. So, I downloaded a mod where you could play Minecraft using a controller. Changed some things in the code, and, you know, then, you know, made it so it can be compatible for Nintendo 64. Now... The timestamp on your screen now is when the video begins. But if you do want to see the controls of this thing and what the controls were, because I couldn't map it. The second I put in a code, it was already pre-mapped and I don't know how to change the mapping. So, um, yeah, if you do want to see the controls I use, please just stick around. I'm going to go through it now. And if you don't, go to the timestamp on the screen and it'll take you to the start of the challenge. So if I die, I lose the challenge. And I have to kill 10 mobs, I have to make a basic house, and I have to make basic tools. That's how I win the challenge. If you do want to see me do more things with the Nintendo 64 controller, please comment that down below. And I will do it, because I do want to do more things with this. It, it is quite cool. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. So the controls are pretty basic. I mean, the joystick is to move, like, you know, forward, back, left, right. I wanted it to turn the camera, but it wouldn't. This is to go third person. This does nothing, this does nothing, this drops. Z does absolutely nothing. Hit and use of these. See up is inventory. Jump. Nothing. Nothing. Inventory scroll. Pause. That's the controls. That. What more can I add? To move my camera, I had to use my mouse. Uh, where's my mouse? Uh, my mouse. Yeah, you can see my mouse right here. Yeah, I had to use that to uh, change my camera around because this wouldn't. And I wanted to use this to be my left and right and upwards and forwards. But, you know, it, it ended up being this. And I don't know how to change it. So, that's the controls. So, already I know that I'm going to have difficulty moving around. Because this is just controlling my movement, and then my mouse is controlling my camera. But then I can't take my hand off my mouse and pick <laughs> off my inventory and hit, and then to change. So it's going to be really awkward to do things. It's going to be really, really awkward to do things. So um, yeah, we're going to look for a tree. 
this this one, this one. There was one right here. I don't know why I said I need to look. I mean, every button pretty much does something apart from the Z button at the back. And that kind of bugs me a little bit. Okay, we, we're getting our first wood, our first pieces of wood. We're gonna, we're gonna do it. We're, we're doing it. So obviously we need to make a little base. We need to get materials, like basic materials, what we need to survive. So we need food, a base, and we also need to kill 10 mobs, which is gonna be difficult. Crafting, how are we gonna do this? Let's move my mouse up here, right? So we have my little cursor. We're gonna select the block with C down. And where's it gone? <laughs> where? Oh, uh, where is it gone? <laughs> Wait. Where is it? Why? Wait, let me press C up. And I, I just drop it. Okay, now it's in my inventory again. And then... Oh, it's in my mouse! My mouse has it! Oh. Okay, so I can place it there, and I can pick it, can I... I think we have to do all our crafting with our mouse, because I I don't think this is gonna, the controller wants to craft, I didn't even make a crafting table, I hate this so much, I wish I didn't have to do this like this, I literally just wanted this controller to play Pokemon Stadium and Super Mario, and that, that's all I wanted it for, and then I decided to do this, place this down, we'll get stick if I can just make d-pad nothing oh this does this just okay if I just put wait can I I can hit while I'm on the crafting table what I'm hitting on the crafting table all right oh look at that that was quite smooth that was quite smooth I'm quite proud of myself with that we're also gonna get some food from oh there's a cow um No, no, please, please stop running. Ah, uh, oh, please stop running. Please stop running. I don't know where you've gone. Oh, there we go. No, dude, please don't go behind me. Please don't go behind me. There we go. Thank you. Thank you very much. Where's our crafting table gone? I think it's over here. I think that's where I remember it being. Uh, there it is. Wait, is it? No, that. Oh, there it is. I got confused with the brown sheep for a minute. Into the forest we go to get more wood. Oh, we have to. <sighs> okay, that wasn't actually that bad. Let's break from social norms. We're only going to get the bottom two planks. <laughs> oh, God. Wait. Wait. Okay. Okay, there we go. Look how cool we are. We're so cool. Wait, what the? Okay, I'm gonna get my stone from here. I don't even have a pickaxe. A, A, A. Left. Left. I was pressing right. Right, we need a pickaxe. Okay. One. Two. Seven. Eight. Eleven. 12, 13, but I don't know why I'm counting. I just need like at least 30, I think. I work out for my hands, dude. I have to switch like every two seconds to like a different one. Okay. How do we get back? Oh, okay. Right. I'm so stupid. Actually, no, I'm really smart. A shovel and a hoe. There we go. We have our basic tools. What we need. Apart from a bow. We need a bow. We need a bow. That means we need... Wait, what? <laughs> I don't want to change... Wait. Okay. Now, get, getting out. How, how are we going to go about... Um... Yeah. Swimming. We need some sand for the... For a house, so we need like a window. Okay, there we go. To the hills we go. Parkour. 
Oh, we're so good at Minecraft. We're so good at Minecraft, we're so good at Minecraft. Look what I was doing, parkour. Okay, I'm getting used to the controls a bit, it's quite kind of easy. I'm gonna go down here, cause some coal here, I can make some torches. A, A, A. We just need like, um, four pieces, we'll go. And into the mountain we go. Because it's turning night time, so this was actually timed quite perfectly, you know, it's turning night time. We're making a house, we're gonna be somewhat safe. <laughs> For the most part, anyway, I mean, you know. I'm just mashing C down and it actually cancels out like the breaking. <laughs> so I should stop spamming C down, but I just can't help it. Oh, I've. That's where my coal was. That, I guess that's where the window is going to go then. Now we need our crafting table. And we need to make a furnace and we need to make a chest. I pressed C by accident. I'm. I'm just... Wait, if I. I want to quick move this into my hotbar. So quick move would be B. 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 I'm pressing B. There's no X, Y. Okay, so Y is an equivalent to C up. X would be C left. A is C down. So B would be this, uh, C right, I think. But I picked it up and it's just not quick moving. Therefore, I don't, I don't know. go there and then we have our house we have a very nice and, and pretty house apart from the window that still needs to be put in but that's besides the point we do our next mission of um, you know going and killing things when we get our torches nope okay there we go things to kill things to kill what can we kill okay we need to kill 10 hot hostile mobs I, I'm pretty sure I said a different number before, but it is 10. That's what I've written down. 10. So there's one zombie over there. So that'll be our first one. Stay back. Stay back. I'm using an N64 controller. Stay back. Oh, there's a spider. If I die, I, please, I can't die. I am not allowed to die. Oh, two. Huh. I'm so good at this game. I'm so good. Oh my god, what is hitting me? What what was that? What hit me? Oh my god, oh no. Oh no. Right. Okay. 